With the new year here, a new year, tax time is just around the corner. Happy New Year. With the economy struggling and many cash strapped, you could be very tempted by refund anticipation loans, or RALs. And joining us to talk more about that with a warning, Janet Jenkins from the Wisconsin Department of Ag Trade and Consumer Protection. And boy, they've got that right. A lot of people in this economy want that cash and need it and may may go for this. What 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 are these exactly, these RALs? They're a loan that one can take out when they file their taxes in order to get their refund either instantly or within a day or so. I even saw a commercial just a couple of days ago that even before you get your W-2, mm -hmm. um, this one company, you could go in and just show them your pay stub and they would give you a loan until you got your W-2 to file your taxes. These things must have tr a tremendous interest rate. Uh, they do. Some of them can be, you know, 700%. Oh, for heaven's sake. And so they really suck up a lot of people's money, which is really their refund. But I'm really surprised. A lot of people do this. Yes, they do. It's like one in 13 or something? Yeah, that's right. Oh, man. And this is what, what I was also interesting, too. This kind of also hurts when people do this. The, the local economy and the tax... Uh, the tax money that the, the, the local community would get, right? Right, because these cost a lot of money, which simply goes to the business mm -hmm. um, that is doing, usually it's tax preparers who give these loans out. So what is your recommendation from Consumer Protection? Don't do it. Yeah. There are other ways to get your tax refund relatively quickly. One is to file electronically, and you mm -hmm. can do that through a tax preparer. If you have a bank account, um, and have your refund direct deposited um, into your account, you can get your federal refund within 10 days and your state refund um, within three to five days. So it's, it's really quick. I mean, so you're not, you know, if you can't wait for 10 days, then things are pretty sad. Well, I bet you. Any, any other tax-related things that the consumer should look out for this time of year besides these RAL things? Um, I think one thing that uh, the legislature passed a law last session uh, that indicates that if tax preparers are going to share your information, mm -hmm. who even knew that they did, mm -hmm. they have to give you a consent form for you to sign in order for them to be able to do that. Previously, they didn't have to even let you know that really? they were sharing their information. All right, so that's, that's a good thing to ask for if you have your tax that's right. prepared. All right, ask for that because, yeah, they want that because that's, I mean, you're Social Security, everything about you is on there. Uh, yes. There goes your identity out the window. All right. Some good tips. Jenna, thank you. Thank and you. Have a very nice new year. And if you have any questions, if you have any problems consumer related, don't hesitate to call, right? Guess what you guys are there for? Absolutely. All right. Call that number or uh, there's the website too to Wisconsin Ag Trade and Consumer Protection. They're, for, they're there for you.